In part 12 of our build guide, we continue reorganizing the body harness to fit the goblin. Find the two longest ground wires coming from the ground lugs. They'll be used to extend the fuel pump grounds later. Route these two grounds toward the fuse box. Next, find the two shorter ground wires coming from the ground lugs. These need to be extended. Cut two six foot extensions from the roll of driver's side grounds removed in an earlier video. This roll will be the one without the large defroster ground wire. Roll the extra grounds up and put them away. Strip the ends of the short ground lug wires and the ends of the extensions. Slide heat shrink on the ground lug wires. Twist the wires together. Solder the wires and cover the exposed portions with heat shrink. Route these wires toward the fuse box. Unwrap the power steering harness. Lay the fuse block on top of the housing. Route the red power steering wire and the two fuse block multi-plug harnesses beside each other and tape as shown. Remove the fuse block. Route the power string wire toward the BCM and cut the red positive wire about one foot from the black plug. Cut the long red wire coming from the BCM. Leave about six inches from the BCM. Now find the fused BCM power wire that was removed in the last video. Solder the fused wire to the short wire you just cut near the BCM. Solder the long leftover BCM wire to the power steering wire coming from the fuse box. Pull the large red power wire toward the BCM. Grab the BCM and pull the slack out of the main harness. While holding tension on the harness, attach the BCM to the table. Find and cut the light blue parking brake wire. It has a small black connector on the end. Extend this wire by 48 inches.
Unwind the coil of twisted data wires and tape up the purple and black engine connector about 6 inches back. Add the long black defroster wire to the harness. Leave a foot of excess on the fuse box end and 4 extra feet on the BCM end. We'll use this to extend the radiator fan wire later. Pull the main connector toward the BCM and tape near the plug to hold it in place. Tape about every 6 inches to keep this section of wire organized. Tape the purple and black connector as shown. Leave about 3 inches of wire hanging out. Pull the twisted data wires to the BCM. Bundle and tape the wires near the fuse box as shown. Collect the tail light wires and the two longest grounds. There should be seven wires, light blue, light green, yellow, green, brown, and two black ground wires. Starting near the main harness, tape these together for about six inches. Roll them up for later use. Route the fuel pump wires and two other grounds as shown and tape them to the main harness. Cut all five wires about 12 inches from the fuse box. Strip the ends and twist the ground wires together. Cut the white plug from the fuel pump harness. If your donor was a lower emission vehicle, you won't have this harness. Go to our website to see how to handle this. Cut about 12 inches from the black plug. Solder the wires together making sure to match the colors. Tape the fuel pump harness back to where it meets the main harness. In the next video, we'll continue to reorganize the body harness to fit the goblin.